Sumner Station behind me has stood here in Bakersfield since the 1800s. But when community members discover that it might be demolished, they immediately flood its social media with photos of family members that have ties to the station. Even one Bakersfield native conjuring up the memories through acrylic on canvas. I was there reliving the memory. Bakersfield native and artist Mike Doyle captures Bakersfield landmarks in acrylic on canvas. His nostalgia of the city he called home for 53 years brought to still life. One of those landmarks being Sumner Station and the train depot that has stood in Old Town Kern since the 19th century. Doyle recalls the train depot fondly, which he spent a lot of time near due to his job. It was really neat. The trains would be rolling through and on break I would go over to the train station. It brings back a lot of fond memories. And my wife, when she, uh, at that time, when she used to go to work, she would stop by and say hi. The buyer of his first Sumner Station painting was his old Bakersfield College professor, David Rea. The two reconnected over breakfast about a month ago, and that's when Doyle learned of the demolition. And he goes, you ought to paint another painting and send it to Council Member Gonzalez because he's a real advocate for saving it. And so Doyle did paint more and got even more buyers, but some record of the painting did make it to Bakersfield City Council member Andre Gonzalez, who has been working alongside community organizations like the Hub of Bakersfield to keep the current owners Union Pacific from demolishing it after they vacate the property to move to another office space. I think that speaks a lot about our community that yes, we're looking towards the future as Bakersfield grows and we become more urban. Uh, and dealing with lots of challenges in that regard. But at the same time, we respect and honor our history and our past. Gonzalez pointing to past historic buildings in peril here to stay, like the 1800 building, the Padre Hotel, and even the Bakersfield Fox, a landmark, he says, that people far and wide admire and take photos of. Well, that could have went away in the mid-90s if it wasn't for community members who, who, who came together, who raised the money, and who said, we are not going to lose this for our community. Um, they gave us all a gift. Gonzalez adding that he's been in talks with Union Pacific to hold off demolition until he can bring forth the issue to city council on May 5th. He and some city staff planning to propose the city take ownership of Sumner Station and through a private developer look for adaptive reuse, such as turning it into a food hall. Meanwhile, 23 ABC did reach out to Union Pacific about their decision. They told us in a statement that Union Pacific recently met with the city of Bakersfield to discuss potential opportunities for future use of the depot. Discussions are ongoing and no decision has been made on the future of the depot at this time. Gonzalez says that anyone that still wants to see Sumner Station stand here in Old Town Kern should go directly to Union Pacific and state how they are feeling. We'll have a link to that on our website, turn to 23.com. Here in downtown Bakersfield, Kristen Bartow, on 23 ABC News, connecting you.